Wild Grass Mills, which is a big, big, this is a giant mega mall. And just so that you have an idea, this is the second most visited tourist site in Florida, the second after Disney World. Can you believe that? Now, I thought it was an interesting place to film because it's so unusual. So come and join me and let's discover this mega mall. Let's see. Okay, here's the directory. This small mega mall has four avenues and um, lots of stores at each avenue. You just have to follow the signs. I recommend that you spend a whole day here because there's so much to see and there's so many outlets. So here you find mostly outlet stores, which are stores that have merchandise that was overstocked or that have, um, they have stuff from like previous seasons. So you find a mix of stores. You have like regular luxury stores like Prada, but then you have like outlet stores that I talked about before, like La Coast Outlet, but it'll say outlet. Then there are discount stores and they usually sell clothes that have like a little flaw and they buy the merchandise straight from the manufacturer. So Marshalls is an example of a discount store. Usually their products have maybe a little insignificant flaw that you hardly notice, but Okay, now what's the deal with all these suitcases? Huh? Anybody know? One of the most unusual things about this mall is that people are walking around with suitcases. They have a suitcase outlet, a Samsonite factory outlet here. More suitcases. So tourists come here, stuff their shopping straight in the suitcase, and take it back to their country. Alright, I'm in the fitting room right now. One of the reasons why I like to shop in the States is because you get your size and you can get it in petite, in medium, and in tall. So that's really good because like for curvy, short people like me, it's very difficult to find jeans that fit. But because usually if you get like a regular size, regular like for a medium sized person, um, the knees end up at like near my feet, you know, so uh, everything is in proportion. So the knees are where the knees are supposed to be and the waist is where the waist is supposed to be. And for guys, you know how it works. It's like 36 by 30, which means 36 waist by 30 length. Okay, so I just bought two pairs of jeans that fit me, okay? I want to emphasize that, that fit me for only $42, and that's pretty good. ATM machine, if you need to get money, very important. You have currency exchange. Here's the exchange rate right there. So you can get money here, exchange money here. This looks like a cool place. It's a wild place to shop and eat, it says. It looks really cool. They have a little gym for kids here to keep busy. It's a little playground. And look, there's a suitcase in here. Isn't that funny? I think you guys get the picture. You can rest. This is the food court where you can drop by if you want to have a snack. They have a sushi bar here. But you know, you really don't find like great bargains. You really have to dig deep and look around a lot. Like, like I said, I got jeans for $20, but they're not, you know, like they're Lee's. They're not Levi's and um, Depends what you're looking for. Okay, hoppers, that's all for today. I ran out of money. My hands are full of bags, so it was a lot of fun shopping here. Um, I still find it amazing at the fact that this is the number two tourist spot in Florida. Uh, I don't know, I think I like Disney World better, but it's a good place to come to if you wanna do some heavy duty shopping. So I'll see you guys. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe.
Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.